game number one and starting in five, four, three, two, one, Tetris. Good luck, have fun. And we're starting the same seed, everything is looking nice and sharp as we end. Gerald are on their first game. And so far, they are gonna get a several Tetris, very similar builds, uh, despite the different placements. Oh, Gerald, not sure what he tried to do there. Maybe he misread the board or misflipped that L. But that's gonna force him to burn a little bit early and give uh, SV a edge here. And SV is gonna take advantage of this, taking the lead and maintaining it at 68. No burns from SV yet, and he remains ready. That was for SV, SV at 91. Gerald is clean and back to the game himself. Gerald at 36, SV at 91, that is for both SV at 59, Gerald, I'm uh, sorry, SV at 114, Gerald at 59, SV is still trying to go perfect, but has to be very careful not to destabilize the board too much, he's doing a nice adjustment on that J, the Lombard comes and he remains 6 steps in a row at 136. Gerald at 82, Tetris 4 both again, 102 for uh, Gerald and 115, one, sorry, 104 for Gerald, 159 for SV, SV remains uh, playing uh, very cleanly but had to start burning as the board went a bit to stay unstable, he's gonna get a Tetris, SV right now and 185, Gerald at 129, so two Tetris and a half lead for SV as we suggesting Tetris for Gerald I wonder when they're gonna send the oh a bit of a misery there for Gerald he had just to get the Tetris I'm not sure what's the issue if it's his controller or something not working quite right as we and Gerald trying to get their game on we got as we maintain the lead at 234. Gerald best streamer, for real. Uh, did I put something on the title that indicated that? Uh, I think I put this I there for some reason. There we go. Uh, as is a very good pel person too though, yeah. Very cool players. Uh, I, I was, uh, I'm still thinking of the top 25 survey for next, for well, for this month that's gonna be... I haven't received it yet, so I was wondering because it's been, a, it's been pretty a pretty dynamic month uh, with uh, like um, XT's record and some players getting some top positions in the in CTL right now. For example, Division One B has the uh, uh, Alex T and I will win in on Division One B and Dog and Scooty Division One C. So still. A uh, three horse run between Dan, SV, and Gerald for that, those two spots in Division 1A, which we'll see tomorrow, I think, to wrap it up. SV in the lead at 374, Gerald at 323. SV is setting up. Tetris 4, SV 398, Gerald at 324. You know, watching from his phone, it's kind of funny to, to watch the stream within the stream. That is from Gerald, Gerald at 349, SV maintained the lead at 422. SV is setting up this game a bit high. Uh, Gerald at 350, uh, SV 447. So SV building a pretty healthy lead here of the three Tetris and change. Tetris for both again. And another one, 492 for SV and 418 for Gerald. We are approaching transition. Gerald is uh, setting up, SV doing the same. That is for Gerald. Gerald at 441, SV 515. That is for Gerald. Gerald right now, 464, SV 538. SV 
and you know having to do some clean cleanup so transition is approaching and this that was for SV to 561 early shift from SV and that's when I force him to clean up an opportunity here for Gerald to catch up 467 for Gerald 574 SV so over a hundred thousand points lead as transition is approaching nine lines left for SV and 10 for Gerald getting attached to 592 looks like a Tetris for Gerald Gerald at 515 SV at 593 Tetris for Gerald Gerald at 538 SV 596 that is for Gerald Gerald right now at 562 and the 520 transitioning and 562 transition for Gerald. Gerald running into some trouble as he couldn't get the S spin. He's gonna get Tetris ready. Tetris for Gerald 645. Tetris for SV 592. Gerald right now at. Uh, Gerald right now at 643, Ger uh, SV at 723, Tetris for Gerald 669, hey now. Gerald right now at 724, SV at 781. Tetris for Gerald, Gerald at 7.54 as we get Tetris to 810. Tetris for Gerald catching up 7.82. It's a very close one. Tetris for SV 7.39, 8.39. Tetris for Gerald 8.11. So less than a Tetris separating the players right now. Tetris for SV maintaining the lead at 8.68. Gerald is ready. And Gerald is ready to at 8.12, as we at 8.69. Tetris for Gerald, Gerald at 8.43, SV at 8.71, triple for Gerald, Tetris for SV maintain the lead at 9.01, Tetris for Gerald 8.82, SV at 9.31, SV is ready, Tetris for Gerald 9.13 catching up, and SV is gonna get a Tetris to 8.62, needs an L, needs a Lombard, Oh, this is getting too dangerous for SV. SV status ready though. This is getting very risky as the Lombard is not coming. He managed to get the wall open, but uh, Gerald is catching up already. 950 for Gerald. Tetris for SV. A million and three getting the max out into level 26. It's a very close one. Tetris for Gerald. 984. And another one to a million 17. Taking the lead, but Gerald uh, as he responds with the Tetris to a million 36. A pretty neck and neck game. It has to be slightly behind in lines, but not much to compensate for the deficits that Gerald is pushing towards Tetris for Gerald taking the lead, but SV responds to take the lead back. A million one hundred and six from SV, million eighty seven for Gerald is gonna get intense into level uh, 30, uh, 29 and beyond. Gerald is ready at a million eighty eight going for room for two more Tetris as he couldn't get the square over so this is gonna limit his space to work with with only one Tetris left he has to be careful let's be in trouble as we got only four lines left transition for uh, Gerald at 100 million 139 as we need to be very careful getting to the kill screen at a million 153 and needs to survive this with a very rough lumbar dependency but he's getting some very good burns Gerald at 1,213,000 is in the lead and SV couldn't get further than 29, topping at 1,159,000. Very close one, but Gerald was able to play the longer game and take his game number one. GG. Let's give the point to Gerald and move on to the next one. Looks like Gerald feels confident in this game. We'll see how far he goes. I'm gonna give the point to. I'm gonna give the next seed, which is gonna be uh, F B. Very very close one. You know, just catching up to S V starting level twenty six or so. So was a very strong game from Gerald uh, from both players. In any case.
And it looks like Gerald wants to go for the rollover at the very least. Still doable. Oh, that he didn't go over. One point four six still a pretty good game from Gerald to one Tetris. And we are off and we got the same pieces. So everything is looking nice. Mm, some interesting adjustments there from SV to keep things pretty compact and looks like he will be getting Tetris ready first uh, But Jared isn't that far behind. He's gonna be a Tetris after the other No player in a lead yet. Well, we are having some Okay, looks like SV was having some competitive issues, but looks like everything is smooth out uh, SV at 22 and Gerald at 22 and the lumbar is not coming so players must be careful Tetris for Gerald SV gets a Tetris Tetris for Gerald SV trying to get back its current position he is ready as Gerald is cleaning up Gerald at 68 SV is gonna go for his first burn Gerald might go for his as well as the board begin a bit unstable and the lumbar are pretty scarce on this one. These players need to be careful. There's the Espin and the Tetris for SV taking the lead at, at 75. Gerald at 71. SV is setting up right and getting a Tetris to 98. As uh, Gerald responds, but still behind uh, SV. SV at 97. Gerald, I'm sorry, Gerald 97. SV at 121 after the Tetris. Gerald with the Tetris to 120. So pretty much two uh, Tetrises, pretty much Tetris and a half, separating the players, very close one. Um, Gerald is ready. SV is ready, nice L spin there to clean up, and there's a Tetris for G SV, Tetris for Gerald. 2,000 points separating these players, this is a very close one, Tetris for Gerald, Gerald at 166, SV at 147. SV is ready. Oh, as we going for some delayed burns, gets the work clean. Oh, Gerald ran into some traffic as the lumbar is taking a bit to come. Oh, this game dangerous for both players. Gerald is still with the well open though. Uh, but oh, as we with a flat uh, miss drop and hit up at 154. Gerald was able to take this at 195. He's already at match point. We have the candle in five, four, three, two. One Tetris. Richard, you're so good at Spooker Updater. Thank you. I tried my best. <laughs> I think my main inspiration was Max Out Bot from Max Out Club. <laughs> it's like that that's the that the streamer I aspire to be. Lol. <laughs> anyway, uh we got SV and Gerald setting up. Gerald starting with some uh, dirty board right now, so he's gonna have to dig. Gerald in the meantime, waiting for the lumbar. We have to start with a drought, and neither player with a Tetris. There's a Tetris for both. Your main inspirations was really playing on my streams. I mean, technically, um, no. I mean, not in a negative way, you know, because. If I see the stats, your streams normally give me like an edge on wins, so that's good. But I'm kind of like, I don't know, I know I can be a bit grumpy and and insistent on, especially when my setup didn't allow me to screen look originally. So it was very hard for me, I couldn't screen look at all and that was very hard for me to, to get, to keep up with my, my games. Um, but in any case, we get Gerald at 98, Tetris for SV at 82, so Gerald off to a slight lead here, um, just under a Tetris, yeah, so, so yeah, I'm very, I'm very like, I don't know, like, a score of this word became like a very important thing for me as a streamer, because I know that there are, play, play, there are streamers that are more candid and like to talk about stuff, but I, I, I really, like, it's not quite like I'm trying to concentrate in the game and it's quite like distracting at times. Um, so yeah. But now that I have a setup that kind of lets me screen look, I tend to complain less. Although, something I do complain a little bit is like, the streamers tend to have their their levels too low. I don't know why. Like, you have to put in living in yellow players, uh, streamers. All right. 
So 197 for Gerald and 175 for SV. So Gerald maintaining a slight lead and SV is going to take the lead with a Tetris. 199 for SV, 201 for Gerald. So this is going to be pretty neck and neck for a while into this second half. Tabanoku already topped out, so yeah, Tabanoku, your time for Division 1 will come, I hope. <laughs> Yo, and let me, how do you do this season? I haven't kept up with much, like, what's happening in CTL. Uh, this was Division 4A, and okay, looks like Tabanoku is going to be in Division 3, so... Congratulations. Ooh, SB going very aggressive and misses that spins. This is not looking good for SV. He's being forced to dig at a very important time when uh, Gerald is going to be able to take a lead and expand it. 295 for Gerald, 277 for SV. Should I play in Division 1 next season? Uh, yes, Sunny. That, that, that helps with the rankings. I mean... I'm very annoyed that you didn't make the ranking in last month by a single point. That was like, oh no. Yeah. Gerald right now at 363 in the lead, but SB is recovering pretty nicely at 345, less than that was behind. Ah, oh, there was a raid from Roman. I didn't see it. When did Roman raid us? <laughs> Thank you very much, Server43. Uh, he said, let's go as we like, yeah, like five minutes ago. Sorry about that. I didn't notice. That is for Gerald. Gerald at 390, SV at 371. SV at 394, Gerald at 390. So this is a very neck and neck game as we are approaching 100 lines. 413 for Gerald. SV at 394, so less than that separating the players still, and there SV is gonna go for a triple out of safety. That is for SV, SV at 422, Gerald at 415. So SV with a slight lead here, but Gerald's gonna take the lead back at 440. So this is gonna be back and forth for a bit. That is for SV taking the lead at 445, Gerald at 440 still. Gerald is ready though, he's gonna take the lead back at 462. And transition is gonna come to this player soon. Gerald has 20 lines left, SV has 16. That was for both players, eight, uh, 485 for Gerald and 515 for SV. That is for, G oh, Gerald with a misflip. This is a very dangerous situation, but he managed to get a lumbar and a burn just in time to fix everything. Gerald right now at 509, SV at 538. Gerald's gonna get the well opened. Tetris for Gerald. Gerald at 535. And SV at 539. So. And transition came to a Gerald first. 537 SV with one line left. Look like he might not be able to wait for much longer. He's gonna go for the Tetris. Transition at 563. And another one to 587. Pretty aggressive play from SV to try to maintain the lead. And he's doing so. Gerald at 562, Tetris ready, SV at 590. Gerald is ready, SV is ready. Gerald is in. Oh, blocked the well as Lombard came, SV blocked the well as well. Both players waiting for another Lombard, but SV blocked the well again. He's adding lots of weight on top of the well, so he needs to be careful. SV at 597, man gets the well open and a Tetris to 624. Gerald is waiting for a Lombard at 679, Tetris for SV and for Gerald. Gerald at, five, at 607, SV maintaining the lead at 651. So this is a very close one. This is the game that SV needs to win to stay alive here. Gerald's gonna get a dirty Tetris in column 5 at 636, SV at 682, SV is ready, Gerald is setting up, SV is setting up now, Tetris 4, SV 709, Tetris 4, Gerald 667, SV at 709, and another one to 738, Tetris 4, Gerald 695, so Gerald behind in score and pace, nice stuck on the team and he is ready. And uh, SV is ready, Tetris 4, SV, Tetris 4, Gerald, Tetris 4, uh, Gerald, 754, catching up, SV is waiting for a Lombard, SV is ready, Gerald is ready, 
This game dangerous for uh, Gerald. Gerald getting the well open as we get a Tetris. Maintain the lead at 802. Tetris for Gerald. 787. Gerald is Tetris ready. Tetris for SV. SV at 834. Uh, SV going for a nice sequence of tucks. The result in resolving the Tetris. Tetris for Gerald. Gerald missing the S uh, Z spin. So things are going a bit uh, slower for Gerald right now. He gets a well open though. Gerald right now at 8.54, SV at 9.29. Uh, triple there for Gerald, SV at 9.29. Tetris 4, SV. Gerald at 8.67, SV is setting up. Tetris 4, Gerald, Gerald at 900, SV at 9.97, the max is coming. And oh, as we with some trouble into level 27 here, he needs to get the well open. But the sequence is not friendly, he's getting some good pieces finally, but still not quite open. As we slowly but surely trying to get the well open, but this is giving the opportunity to Gerald to catch up. Gerald is waiting for a lumbar though. Gerald at 918, as we maintain the lead, and he gets the max at a million 45. That is for a Gerald, Gerald at 955. So SV is gonna get to the kill to a nine million fifty one, and Gerald is gonna have to catch up to that. Uh, he has to clean up first. SV building a bit high at million sixty six into level thirty. Gerald at nine seventy three, so lots of work to do. As we couldn't get the L over, gonna get the lumber over, but got another lumber over. Oh my goodness, SV surviving this. But still high, so he needs to be very careful. He's still getting pieces over, but he might not be able to do much afterwards. Stopping at a million seventy-six, million seventy-eight, the score for Gerald to take this and the match. Oh, but the miss drops. This is looking pretty dire for Gerald. Gerald needs to open the well and gets a triple to million and four. Needs to million a million seventy-seven, million seventy-seven. So still in the chase down. Tetris and a half to go, score-wise. Million seventy seven for Gerald to take the game and the match. Still in the chase at a million twenty three as he's going through a bit of a, a couple droughts there here and there. So Gerald trying to line it out pretty much. He has enough wrong way to do so. Gerald at a million thirty six. It's a million seventy seven. Million 43, 44, he might need a slight, a slightly, something uh, something more than line burns. And now he has enough runway for, for it to get to level 39 by lining it out, and he's doing so. He's no longer troll rolling, he's trolling us with those singles. Oh my goodness, he's gonna go for the edge. Oh my goodness. Million 69. Hey now, million seventy one, seventy two, seventy three, seventy four. Oh my goodness! Oh no! Oh my goodness! Seventy five, and that's it. Oh, that was a very close one. That was a close call there for Gerald. That was any means of who will have ended him just before the the target score. But it was a win for Gerald nonetheless, reaching level thirty eight throughout and then some and he takes game number three he had sweep after sweep now that wasn't a sweep on the previous one that was three two one so that was a sweep for gerald let me feature him in the winner scene and let me see let me no he say no or he's in by left let me go uh there we go there is Gerald, our winner of this second stream. Well, congrats, Lineout Freeman. Says <laughs> Sunny. That was a scary lineout. So that was all from me tonight. I'm gonna rape people. Out of Tetris for Dangler. T spin for Alex. Another Tetris for Dangler. There you go, it's fixed. It's fine, 71 lines. 277, plays 256. So Alex with about a Tetris and change lead here in pace. Both players will score.
Oh, look at that. Look at that. That was that was galaxy brain from Alex. Setting up that spin is very smart. A score a Tetris there. A Tetris for Dangler. Dangler ahead in lines has shown us a little bit of a preview of what Alex is about to get. And that is a 20-piece drought. There's a long bar bang Tetris for Alex. Drought? What drought? <laughs> Alex handled that perfectly. We're approaching the 100 line turn, and Dangler gonna make it well before Alex. Gonna Tetris into it at 384. Alex with a Tetris. Of course, Dangler was playing high at the beginning, which is why there's a line discrepancy this game. Uh, covering the well just as the long bar shows up, and you can see the pain in Alex's face as it happens. We've all been there. Yeah, check out that Division One prize pool. It's, it's up there. Remember, all that money goes to the players. The winner getting a good half of it. Technirus, good evening. Welcome in. Dangler playing with a high board again. This time we're close to transition... I'm gonna take that triple. Could be able to work this down. Uh, there's a Tetris for Dangler. And these paces have uh, kind of slowed down from game number one. Another Tetris. Still gonna hit 500,000 though, and the Tetris will bring him to 530 going to level 19. Alex still with five lines to go to transition. Now four. One Tetris remaining. But run, it says 125. See, I told you. Level 19. <laughs> Another Tetris for Alex. Another Tetris for Dangler, 605. Tetris for Alex to go to 577. Another Tetris for Alex. It's a 602. This game is uh, kind of slipping away from Dangler a bit. Sure, Alex has to get the Tetrises to realize this pace lead, but it is an Alex T pace lead at the moment. Another Tetris for both players as level's about to go off the rails for Alex. As we hit level 21. Another Tetris for Alex. 718 for Dangler. 660 for Alex. Alex with a long bar dependency here. It's just going to plug the well. Get that long bar down there. And he'll hit level 22. And he's going to build up. He's back by four Tetrises. Score a Tetris there as Dangler has definitely caught the pace lead back up. He's ahead by 12 lines, but also by three Tetrises. Actually, this is kind of neck and neck. In pace. Flat burn for Alex, which is not what he was intending. <laughs> Just kind of see him take a double take at that. He's going to open up the right side. Hopefully he doesn't do that again. Another Tetris. Probably the roller curse of the double uh, the double spin that we often see. But this has given Dangler a pretty big lead here. This is kind of a repeat of game number one right now, where Dangler has a big lead on 19. It's now 146,000 points. The main difference is is that Alex has extra lines to work with. And he'll Tetris into level 25 at 798. Dangler's at 941 on level 26. Looking for the back-to-back -back max out. Another Tetris for Dangler. Bang Tetris for Alex. There's a Tetris for Dangler. Dangler with the max out, 1.01. Alex, around level 27, gets that long bar over for the Tetris. Still has four to go before the level 29 transition. Dangler only has one, and there it is, 
And we'll get some clears into level 29 to get the B on the board. Angler is off and running in level 29. Double long bar dependency here for Alex. Oh, oh wow. It's just going to take the triple. He's not going to take that hole going into level 29. So off and running we go. 1.16 for Dangler. Bang Tetris into the max out. 1.01 for Alex T. Alex's board kind of messy. But I'm sure he's seen worse. And he's going to dig this out as his board is about to go haywire again. He's on level 31. 1.19 for Dangler. 1.03 for Alex. Alex with a rough board right now. He has a long bar dependency in column 2. He's going to just fill it in with an L. He's going to bring this down. Noah's still playing, though. 1.2. He's got the C on the board. Dangler. This time, holding it together on the kill screen. Keep in mind, at level 39, we have a double kill screen. Pieces will drop twice as fast. Almost impossible to play. Usually, you can only get a few lines into it, if that. Level 36, Dangler's lead has disappeared. Alex is making a comeback of this. Another Tetris 1.288. Alex has just destroyed the kill screen. He takes the lead. 1.33. Dangler at 1.35 with that Tetris. Alex's board looking a little spicy, but gets that long bar over for the Tetris. This is going to come down to level 38. 1.4 for Dangler. 1.38 for Alex. Tetris to 1.43. Dangler needs a long bar. Bang, Tetris, 1.45 in the double kill screen, but Alex also gets a Tetris, and he's going to take it. Alex, 1.48 on the Tetris. Well, actually, no. Actually, no, because he forgot to turn on the double kill screen. Oh, wait, no, that is the double kill screen. Oh, his game was messed up the whole time. So he gets a 1.5. I'm sorry. I didn't notice that his level was so desynced. And he gets a level 40. Uh, is that a 40? What is that? Is that a 40? What level is that? 345 lines. That is a level 40. Let's go ahead and get them started with game number three. And we'll count them down in three, two, one. Tetris. I mean, it kind of makes sense that Alex was decent because there's no way he caught up to Dangler in level. Like, now that I'm thinking about it, Alex was, like, way behind in lines the whole time. There's no way he should have gotten to 38 at the same time as Dangler. And when he hit 30, when it looked like he hit 39 and it was still going slow, it's like, yeah, he just forgot to turn double kill screen on, but then he actually hit 39, and it's like, well, wait, no, he does have kill screen. And you could tell right away. And then he just kept playing, and he did, just didn't stop until 15 lines later. It's insane. Tacnerus says Alex isn't mortal. Yeah, kids don't often think they're mortal. And one of the things that I think would be so cool to do, like, give it, like, 15 to 20 years. And then let's get all, like, the top players in the room together that were around this time. Like, your Alex's, your Eric's, your uh, Fractal's, Dog, Andy, Gerald, and all these top players just kind of, like, 
talk to him about what they were doing back in the day. Alex is playing with fire right now. You know, get that snap into place. Blue Scooty's grandpa, welcome in. You just missed a heck of a game. That I'm not even sure. <laughs> we saw what everything that was good about it. <laughs> it was amazing. 237 for Noah. Tatras to go to 221 for Alex as he hits 52 lines. We'll score another Tetris. You know, telling Noah to lock in. The problem is the uh, the key is in Alex's hands at this moment. And here's the other thing about it: Alex has been mostly trailing going into level twenty nine. Like, he was down by a lot in game one. And only because of the top out did he get back into it. But this last game, he just dominated the kill screen. This, the kill screen. It was just absolutely unreal. Oh, dear God. Is that a taco mom that I see there? That just ruined our one, two, three, four, five, six? Uh, Alex. Alex might be doing something he hasn't done all season. If he doesn't get a long bar now, he's got an early top! And Dangler will take game number three. The aura of invincibility has just been popped. Let's go ahead and count these folks down for game number four in three, two, one. Tetris. I'm going to be honest, this was looking like my fifth straight sweep cast on the CTL channel. My, la my last four casts have all been sweeps. And this was looking like it was going that way too. But that early top from Alex shows that even the best players in the world are not immune to throwing up some caca on 18. <laughs> that was not intentional. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, the weeper, the... Re the <laughs> I am weeping now. The Reaper causing all sweeps. Uh, it's usually not how it works. Normally, I like to see a lot of blood, but... More Tetris, right? Galazer... Galazer, um, I think, hit the nail on the head as to why Alex did that early top that game. We haven't seen any Parmesan cheese on his stream yet. I mean, I have my bottle still sitting here. <laughs> but Alex hasn't had any. Uh, darn Clem. Oh, um, first time chat says, quote, Alex, do any more crazy shit? I haven't been paying attention for the last few days. Um... He just rolled over the game on level 40. It with the double kill screen. Yeah, he's been doing some crazy stuff. Get a bit of drought here. Both players will get the long bar for the Tetris, though. Alex in the lead, 207 to 189. Another Tetris. Alex T is the calmest, least crazy player ever. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> My God, another Tetris for Alex. Got the lead, 277. Dangler will get an extra Tetris to go to 282, but is ahead in lines. Another Tetris for Alex. 